What's going on everybody? It's your boy Joe Shake 72 coming to you guys with a video right now. Well, the big news today is Michael Kendricks just got released by the Philadelphia Eagles, saving cap of $4.4 million. Wow. Not only that, Paul Worlow that we signed in free agency to fill as a linebacker depth spot, he tore his ACL during the OTA period, voluntary. Um, so... The Eagles trade Kendrick. So what does this mean? This means that there are upcoming guys or guys that Howie is definitely um, still trying to figure out what's going on. Uh, we ha may have some guys to fill in the spots. We are very crowded at the linebacker uh, position and still are today um, with Jordan Hicks and Nigel Bradham uh, and, and Corey Nelson from Denver in free agency, a young prospect that can actually fill in that spot. Or you know what? Nate Gary, Joe Walker. So it's pretty crowded right now. Um, and losing Kendricks isn't a physical loss, but it's a loss to where he still had two years left with 20 something, $28 million left on his deal. And now we have dealt him, and he will be picked up immediately by another team. So good luck to Michael Kendricks. I, I was actually very surprised. We were kind of waiting for this moment for the past few years and didn't really know when this would happen. But it did, and it happened today. <coughs> so not only they didn't get a trade partner, they just flat out released him, saving, like I said before, saving $4.4 million. And the other big no news is Paul Worlow, uh Tours ACL at OTAs today. So now I'm trying to figure out some things and saying, hey, well, with the guys that we have depth-wise in this linebacker position now, this opens competition. Now who's going to start next to Nigel Bradham? That is the big question of what's going to happen. Now can someone play better than Kendricks? Oh, of course. They have plenty of guys that can fill the spot that can get their chance. Howie Roseman wants one of these guys to step up and be that guy. The competition is going to be even better this year at the linebacker position, getting rid of Michael Kendricks. Now, do I wish Michael Kendricks was still on the team? Of course. But business is business. The future is our future. And, you know, he's getting he's up there in age. So, you know, can't be on this team for a long time. You're going to have, what, Nigel Brown start, turning 30, or he is 30, and Kendricks is, what, 31, 30, something like that. Nigel Bradham is more productive, uh, but Michael Kendricks probably had his most productive season last year, especially from preseason all the way down to the end stretch of the Super Bowl. So now, with him being released, Paul Worlow is, is going to be on injured reserve, most likely released. Um, I don't think they're going to keep him on this team, of course, because tearing his ACL, he's, there's no future with him. He was just a rental this year, just a depth guy. Didn't think he was going to start. He was going to be a, ro a rotational linebacker. Uh, played for the Falcons uh, and recently played for the Lions last year, but then hasn't had productive years since he played for the Falcons. Um, so that's where I stand with all this. So Michael Kendricks is released, and the linebacker position is going to get a lot better. We need to get younger at linebacker. We need to get younger at that position badly, and we need to. Somebody's got to step up, whether it's Nate Gary, whether it's Joe Walker, whether it's, uh, whether it's uh, Corey Nelson, like I said, from Denver that we picked up um, in free agency. So now, we'll see what happens, and uh, it's just gotten better, and everybody's going to be like, oh, you lost Kendricks, you're losing all your players. Look, we lost a guy that was formerly very productive, you know, very productive last year, but there are times where you have to, it's not like we don't, we can't replace him, it's not like we can't put someone there, okay, I'm not saying we're putting anybody there, I'm saying there's going to be that guy that's going to do very good this year, it's going to be put right in that spot. Right next to Nigel Bradham. And it's going to get fucking real this year. So I'm, I'm happy about that. Um, and I'm really excited to see who's going to fill that spot. So all we can have is excitement. And then we wish Michael Kendricks, uh, you know, uh, uh, good luck to whatever team he approaches. Um, now he is a free agent. So that's all I got to say, guys. Let me know what you guys think about Michael Kendricks being released. Who you think is going to step up in that linebacker role next to Nigel Bradham this season. Um, should be pretty exciting. So that's all I got to say, guys. So... Shake squad up. Fly goes fly. Thanks for all the support, guys. Peace.